Now, as the digital asset and crypto earns crypto industry continues to grow, we're going to see, in addition to just additional guidance, more legislative adaptation and changes related to this industry. Digital assets are almost its own asset class, and there's a lot of work that needs to be done on how the tax code relates to these types of transactions. Additionally, there's a lot of different stakeholders that want to see cryptocurrency get taxed differently. And unfortunately, there's many groups of people that have a pessimistic view on cryptocurrency and they want to see additional taxes get placed on it. One example of that is the proposed Dame tax, which is the digital asset mining tax that would put a 30% mining tax on cryptocurrency. We've seen calls for proposals to have additional taxes applied to every trade that's made on cryptocurrency. So, you know, there's many different groups that are pushing prohibitive taxes that are going to add additional taxes onto the cryptocurrency industry. And there's really no signs of, of, of these proposals at least slowing down, although none of this has been implemented yet. We need to continue to watch for new bills that are going to introduce new taxes and new tax structures related to this asset class and related to digital assets and cryptocurrency in general.